definitely need to uh, have a healthy uh, fear of heights and uh, you also need to have patience and, um, and a good pair of arms. Hi, my name's uh, Mick Cole. I'm uh, currently the uh, rope access supervisor on the Cotter Dam project. We're doing the uh, hand scaling work. The company I work for is a company called Geovert and uh, they're a, a geotechnical company that uh, specialise in all forms of geotechnical work. Uh, soil nailing, rock drilling, uh, making uh, unstable structures stable, uh, so rock face stabilisation. They came in and originally did the uh, clean scale, um, which was done right at the beginning of the job to make safe, so they could uh, put their infrastructure in to get this excavation done. So in that they had to uh, clean off all the loose rock fall on the, uh, on the faces to my left and right, uh, just with pry bars. Basically what that means is, is they've got to uh, clean any, any loose rock or any drummy rock off the foundation surface so that um, there's, there's, there's no movement in the foundation when they build the, the uh, dam wall. Quite, quite a big job, there's uh, quite a lot of rock to come off. Um, obviously the rock varies from area to area so our time on each area changes. Some, sometimes we could spend five to six weeks on a particular area. Other times we could be there no more than two weeks moving down. So we're jackhammering with 40 pound hammers whilst in suspension on ropes, which can be quite demanding on the arms and the body in general. We try not to spend more than 10, 15 minutes on a hammer at any one time. And we, rope. we always work in pairs. Um, and that's, that's the best way to manage our fatigue we found on this job. And, uh, but like I said, it's, it's, it's a very difficult, demanding job and it's, it's not one for everyone. Because of the, the, the fact that there's a lot of, lot of other activity, there's excavations to be done, uh, there's survey work, there's, uh, there's a lot of labouring at the bottom on the valley floor, so we're obviously going to have a lot of people below us all the time. So it's in our best interest to manage that as best as we can and keep them out of our zone, uh, which we're managing to do. You can, uh, you can do a lot of travelling in this work and uh, can take you to all corners of this country as well as other countries. I've worked in the Northern Territory, uh, I've worked in Western Australia, worked in Tasmania, uh, basically all, all up the east coast of Australia. There's a lot of demand for it in this country, especially for uh, the mining and infrastructure uh, areas. And particularly in this case, for uh, geotechnical work, there's quite a big demand for it in this country as well. Basically, they need a, um, a rope access, a Australian recognised rope access ticket whether that be IRATA, ARA or SPRAT or, um, or TRAC. There's quite a few different um, bodies that recognise rope access. So any of those tickets will work here um, and that's all you need. Five day course and uh, you can come out here and jump on a rope and grab a hammer and go for it. 